Taiwan has reported its first locally transmitted COVID-19 case in eight months. 253 days without an infection has come to an end. It was one of the world's longest runs without domestic transmission. The latest case is believed to have caught the virus earlier this week from a New Zealand pilot. More than 100 contacts of the woman are being tested. Since April 12th, Taiwan has only recorded about 300 imported cases. The island has a total of just over 770 cases and seven deaths. CNA's Victoria Jen has more. It's the first domestic case reported in Taiwan in more than eight months, and it's making health authorities very nervous. Taiwan Health Minister Chen Shizhong personally chaired the press conference to make the announcement. He said the latest case has come into close contact with a New Zealand pilot for EVA Air, who was confirmed infected on December 18th. More may have come into contact with a pilot who had failed to inform authorities on his whereabouts and people he met. So there is growing concern that Taiwan could be facing the threat of a cluster infection if the situation is not contained. Health authorities have also announced that they would cut flights from the UK to half starting Wednesday. It's to avoid imported cases from the UK, where a coronavirus variant has been found that could spread faster than others. Authorities are also requiring travelers arriving from the UK in the last two weeks to get tested. All these efforts are made to ensure that the pandemic is kept at bay here in Taiwan. Victoria Jen, CNA, Taipei.